guys, this is DarkFox127 and welcome to another Scrum Creation Kit tutorial video. Today I'm going to be creating a bard, which I've done before, but I haven't done it very well and given what I know now I can do it much better and cut out half of the rigmarole and prevent the problems where it would take dialogue away from other bards. So don't worry if you're not sure uh, what that's all about, this is a good tutorial for you to kickstart from. So I'm going to go ahead and make a brand new character. I'm going to go under traits first and I'm just going to make a male Nord bard. So I'm going to give the ID TF127 bard. Now if you don't know how to make NPCs then I recommend that you go and watch one of my followers tutorials. That will give you a, a good idea of how to create NPCs. Just going to call the bard bard quite simply. So don't worry what half these things are, I'll just uh, show you what the important stuff is. The factions are quite important. We're going to want the Bard Faction, so Job Bard Faction and the Bard Singer Faction there. So those are the two factions that we're going to want to use and no others are needed. Though you can add other factions like Town Factions and stuff like that but it's not needed for the Bard. Now the voice type I'm going to put as Male Nord. As I understand there are three voice types which you can use. The first voice type is what I'm using now, the male Nord, and if you want a female bard, you can use a female, a young female voice, a female young eager, that's the one, or you can use female commoner, I think it is, but we'll see and we'll check those over in a moment, but I'm just going to use male Nord. The other one is you can use Talzgar's voice, but you can have complications with that so it's not really recommended so the bard that we create won't cost any money you'll be able to go up and just make requests so AI data unaggressive just make him happy help friends and allies brave uh, did I set the stats as bard good thing to do if they are a bard is put the class as bard set the stats to auto calculate uh, just gonna add an AI package a default one default sandbox and we'll go with that one the inventory some people think that you have to put a loot or something in their inventory that you want them to play that's not the case you don't need to do that you don't really need anything in their inventory but it's up to you and the face should be absolutely fine uh, no worries there doesn't need anything fancy and I'll put essential and unique so we can't die and he's unique to the game so go ahead and click OK now I'm just going to go under the character section here and quest and we're going to go under bard so put bard in the filter go under bard songs double click that now when it loads up you'll see a number of different branches here with topics and each of these will sort of show you what the conditions are for bards to sing different songs to take certain requests so if we just go under the first one here it says bard songs ballad 01 request branch so this says that they just have to be a bard singer so obviously the voice doesn't matter this will mean that as long as your bard has the bard singer faction when this song becomes available after a certain point in the main quest they'll be able to sing that so that's automatically there as you can see these are the two for the female young eager and all it requires is the certain faction and that she's female young eager don't worry about the quest thing that's not important so as you can see that's also the same for the age of oppression that's interesting I made a mistake there that's quite funny uh, anyway uh, the other one what else have we got here's the female yeah it's not commoner it's female even toned is the other option so that's the two female voice options that you can have the female young eager option she's a terrible singer uh, but if you do want a, a less experienced bard that sounds like they really need to go back to school then you can go with that option uh, if you want a a better option for a female singer who can actually sing quite well then go for the even toned so there's the young eager and as you can see this one here for the Dragonborn Comes is the male Nord and Bard Singer Faction required. Now that's the one that I'm setting up. So if you go through you can just see what the conditions are. So those are really the three voices that we need. Now I won't bother with the Talzgar one. 
in my last tutorial I was sort of making copies of these and I didn't really know entirely what I was doing but you don't want to go ahead and do that the other interesting option is take a break as long as they are sort of in the Bard Singer faction and they're doing an action then you should be able to get them to take a break that should be another automatic request along with the the extra song so that's all fine I'm just going to click off that we didn't need to actually change anything there but I thought it was helpful to go in and just explain the options so that's that now we're going to want to drag our actor in but before I do that I'm just going to click on my actor in the object window hold down control and tap F4 and click yes to export the face data now this fixes the grey face bug on my machine so if you went and uploaded the mod after doing that it wouldn't actually fix the grey face bug on their machine uh, there's more details on one of my follower tutorials but it will fix it for your machine basically so they're not going to have a grey face when we go in now I'm just going to load up Riverwood and that's where I'm going to place this actor in just ignore any errors it's just typical creation kit being a pain so let's get a Riverwood now you want to put in your filter X marker H and go under static in world objects and we want an X marker heading drag and drop that in if you don't see anything tap M to show the markers just gonna save there we go and I'm just gonna put that there now this X marker heading is going to be their play spot so whenever you go up to a bar and you ask them to play something you'll notice that they'll move up to a specific location and start their song there and that will be this location here so I'm going to just give this a unique name, DF127X for marker and Bard play spot. And then I'm going to go and find my Bard and drag and drop them in. DF127 Bard, ignore any errors. F to drop him to the floor. Now I'm going to double click on him and you want to go under link reference here. You want to double click in that box, select reference in render window, double click on your X marker and the keyword is um, barred play spot make sure you do that otherwise it won't work and in fact talking about it not working sometimes you just get funny bugs where they just don't want to go up to the marker at all and play it's just the typical creation kit sometimes it just doesn't do what it's supposed to but as long as you set it up like this it should work fine so as long as he is now linked to that X marker you should do OK now this means that when you ask him to play like I said he'll go to that marker to sing and even when he's just hanging around he should just go there and start playing stuff like the lute or the flute or he just should start singing on his own accord as long as he's near enough to his marker so just check that that package is in there so he should start using it yep just a package to go over there you could give him a more specific package to go to that marker and try and make sure that he definitely uses it but I'm not going to bother and that should be that our bard should be set up as long as he's got his factions and the right voice type and he's linked to his marker so I'm just going to save that go in game and hopefully our bard will be working okay so I am in the sleeping joints in and it turns out that male bards will only be able to sing within in type locations so if you just look at the image on the screen now that will show you how you add that into the location type of a cell you can visit my cells tutorials just to find out how to mess around with cells and add that in the female bards are absolutely fine any location they should really sing in but the male bards need to be inside an in location like this so if we just go up to him <laughs> he's even got the yes. option to ask what he does around here which will add the quest on if you don't already have it to sort of visit the Bard's College that's a nice addition and if we just say can I make a request sure what can I do for you get him to do the Dragonborn comes Ismir's blessing on you and then he'll go to his play spot which I think he's pretty much our already on hero, our hero claims a and he'll sing for you so that's how you make a bard it can be a little awkward because of the way that Bethesda have set it up it's a really weird thing bards female bards are a lot easier to create and probably a lot better singers so I recommend that you go and try that out see what you think this resource will be available on my website there'll be a link in the description so I hope you find this tutorial useful sorry please do the usual visit my website leave a comment if you like and I'll speak to you next time.